Austin, Texas, 16-year-old Julian Ruiz is shot in the chest by two teenage gang members as he walks to school. Okay, report you fled. And what's really sad and ironic about this is that this young man was in a gang and decided to turn his life around. 11 days after the shooting, at Julian's funeral, grieving family and friends gather to say goodbye. I just can't believe you gone, you know. Never forget it. Never forget my brother. Both Julian's father, Salvador Ruiz, and his stepfather, Peter Morales, are in attendance. There's a history of bad blood between the two men, ever since a nasty divorce and custody battle. This little petty jealousy escalates to the point that the dad doesn't want the stepdad to seize this young boy's body. I want to see my stepson, but I guess I'm not going to be able to. As the stepfather and mother came up to try and view the body, the father stepped in the way and tried to physically block them. And suddenly, just as the service gets underway in this solemn house of worship, Is this the time and the place to really take that into your own hands and start throwing punches? This woman with blonde hair just rushes in and tackles Salvador Ruiz. They killed my son. Not surprisingly, the blonde woman is Julian's mother. Teresa Ruiz. That's not right. My mother's the one who threw the first punch. Okay, my brother. What is your name? Family members should be there to remember what a good kid this was and all the positive things. But here you have really two selfish dads. The Houston police had to be called in to break up the fight. I asked him to step out. He pushed me and I pushed him. Next thing I know, he punched me. Well, we're here for my son. Order is finally restored and the service is able to continue. Julian Ruiz is finally laid to rest.